There's a thing called moral therapeutic deism. You've heard me use that term before, moral therapeutic deism. It's alive and well in the world today, and I think that it might be alive in the local church. The basic tenets of moral therapeutic deism is that there is a creator God. They, they reject the idea that we were evolved, but there is a creator God and that he wants to somewhat be involved in our lives, but only to the extent that we need help figuring something out. So we go to God when we need a, a problem solved for us. When we can't figure out life on our own, then we go to God. We try everything we can do and then we pray. There's little concern for God's daily involvement and interaction and guidance in our daily lives. And he's just sort of the big guy in the sky to be consulted when we cannot figure things out. And our greatest purpose is to be happy to love people and to be kind and to be good because good people go to heaven. Moral therapeutic deism. It is alive and well in the world and I'm afraid that it's alive and well in the church. Now we would put parentheses Jesus, the Jesus edition of moral therapeutic deism because we drop the name of Jesus every now and then. We say, I'm a Christian, but I don't read my Bible. I'm a Christian, but I don't have a prayer life. I'm a Christian, but I don't care what God's will is for me. I just want him to solve my problems when they're too big for me to solve. The Jesus edition of moral therapeutic deism. Here's the problem with that. It doesn't save anyone. The Jesus edition of moral therapeutic deism does not save a single person. John 3.18 says, Whoever believes in him is not condemned. That's a wonderful news. Whoever believes in Jesus is not condemned, but whoever does not believe is condemned already. Because he has not believed in the name of the only Son of God. Your salvation and your eternity hinges upon what you believe about Jesus. If Jesus is just tacked on to your moral therapeutic deism, brother and sister, you will pay dearly. What do you believe about Jesus?